Here's a selection of problems from the identity set having to do with sum and difference and double angle formulas. A classic one in IB would be one like B, uh, problem 10B because it looks so horrible if you were to substitute. Don't substitute. Think of it this way. The tangent of triangle plus blob. Okay, that's going to be the tangent of triangle plus the tangent of blob, right? Over 1 minus the tangent of triangle times the tangent of blob. That's just the formula, right? And you have that at your disposal on the pink sheet or you've memorized it. Now, if you look at this problem here, 10b, this is my triangle and this is my blob. And can you kind of see it totally matches this? totally matches it. So what we could do is since the tangent of triangle plus tangent of blob over 1 minus tangent triangle triangle blob is the tangent of the triangle which is a plus b plus blob which is a minus b which is really quite amazing. It's the tangent of 2a. That's what that simplifies down to. Uh, everything okay with 11? Any other ones that you want to see? And 12 is similar. You just use the formula for. Yes? On the previous slide, 11b? Sure. So the tangent of 2a is the tangent 2 times the tangent of a over 1 minus tangent squared a. Remember that formula? And I think we know that the sine, here let's make a triangle here, the sine of A is negative one-third, the cosine of B, oh, cos, yeah, so then we just fill out the triangle. Nine minus one is eight, square root of eight. Now it looks like we're in quadrant uh, three, so they're both negative. So what's the tangent of A going to be from my triangle? What's the tangent of A? Negative 1 over negative square root of 8. Is that all right? 1 over square root of 8. So then you just plug that in. 2 times 1 over square root of 8 over 1 minus 1 over square root of 8 squared is 1 eighth. So you're going to get 2 over square root of 8 over, looks like, 8 eighths minus 1 eighth is 7 eighths. So it's going to be 16 over 7 square root of 8. That good? Yeah. How about uh, any others here? 12? 12 okay? How about the challenger? Can we do the challenger? Uh, the challenger. Uh, it says find the tangent of alpha. Hmm. I like, let's make up something called beta. Let's make up something called beta. What's the tangent of beta equal to? Using that right triangle. Three tenths. Oh, I'm glad this wasn't a two. You know why? No one wants to be two tenths. Okay, so all right, then then this is going to be tangent alpha plus beta. What's the tangent of alpha plus beta equal to, going to be equal to? Oh, eight. So there's lots and lots of ways to solve it from here. I'll let you uh, figure it out. But that's, those are the problems. Those are a few problems having to do with tangent that we worked with before.